Hello again, unicorns. I'm Vince Smith, and you're watching the Unicorn Network. Reminder that there's only two weeks remaining. Keep calm and carry on. Remember that next week is the fall semester exams. Wednesday, we'll test in third and sixth period. Thursday, we'll test first and second. And last but not least, Friday, we'll test in fourth and fifth period. Remember, unicorns, we'll have fifth period before fourth on Friday as it is early release. Today, November 29th, 16 members of our student council visited Veramindi Elementary School to give each first grader a bag of five books donated generously to us by Chick-fil-A. The books were about character qualities, featuring titles like I am kind, I am brave, I am thankful, etc. Our students took the time to read aloud a few of the books with the children, and everyone had such a fun time. We were so thankful for the opportunity to promote literacy and support our younger students. Attack on Pearl Harbor was a meticulously planned and coordinated assault that aimed to cripple the American Pacific Fleet. In the early hours of that fateful morning, Japanese aircrafts launched a surprise attack on the naval base, targeting battleships, cruisers, and aircraft carriers. The devastation was immense, with over 2,400 Americans losing their lives and numerous ships being destroyed or severely damaged. The attack on Pearl Harbor not only resulted in a significant loss of life and infrastructure, but also served as a catalyst for the United States to enter World War II. The following day, President Franklin D. Roosevelt delivered his infamous infamy speech, declaring war on Japan and rallying the American people to unite in the fight against tyranny. trash cans and more information about your recycling, call this number on the screen. Sports, so let's get into it. Soccer is now in full swing with boys soccer having a home game on the 8th and girls soccer having an away game on the 8th at Smithson Valley. Boys basketball has home games in the competition gym on both the 5th and the 7th. Girls basketball has an away game on the 5th and the 8th. Wish them luck as they head out. If you're watching this on Monday, then golf is at a tournament as we speak, so make sure you congratulate them as they come back. Thank you all so much for watching.